What's up, YouTube? Uh, today, I got some great news for you all. Uh, Taiji has released the iOS 9.2.1 jailbreak at long last. And I'm going to show you how to use it. Uh, and in this example, I'm using my iPhone 5. And I am running iOS 9.2.1, build number 13D15. And um, as you can see, I'm not jailbroken yet. I do not have CDR. Um, this is a so called browser based jailbreak. And I'm going to explain shortly how it works. Um, you can he head over to taiji9.mobi to get all this information and to get the jailbreak, of course. Now, here you get a quick explanation how it work, how this works but basically uh, you can't install Cydia if you're not jailbroken but you can't install normal apps uh, and, but Taiji has found a clever way to hide hide Cydia inside normal apps so the result is that you have an app with Cydia hidden inside of it and you can install this app so what you need to do is simply download this app, uh, start the app and keep it running for about 30 seconds to give CD a time to install itself. Uh, and then simply reboot and we should be done. So click on this icon at the bottom of the page. Now all of these apps are um, all of these apps are patched. Uh, uh, sorry. All of these apps contain Cydia. Uh, but sometimes the apps get uh, patched. And, um, well, then you simply have to try another, another app. Uh, usually it works right away, but sometimes you have to try a few different apps before it works. Uh, but of course, they are all free. So, um, let's just pick an app, doesn't matter which app. Like I said, they all contain Cydia, unless they have been patched. And if they have been patched, then simply try another app. Most of the time it works right away. Uh, that one didn't work. Now this app that I am downloading has Cydia hidden inside of it. So when I start this app, Cydia installation will start in the background. So I start it, leave it running for about 30 seconds, so Cydia can install, have time to install itself. And then when I restart the device, then hopefully I am jailbroken. Simply start the app and uh, now you wait for about 30 seconds because right now Cydia is being installed um, in the background. So you can click around a bit while you wait. It doesn't really matter. What matters is that Cydia has time to install itself. And I am born on. Oh, Uh, 
It needs to be at least 13. Oh. Uh, anyway, now simply hold the power button until you get slide to power off. And when the device is powered off, you simply turn it on again. And if this app wasn't patched, then you will see it uh, when you start your device. Um, and if you don't see anything, then it means that the app has been patched. And, and luckily they are all free. So it doesn't matter, but usually it works right away. Hopefully it works right away now that I'm doing this video to show you. Mm, yes, seems like it's working. Um, now it's... Uh, I don't know what it's doing. The jailbreak is doing something to the system files. Uh, but if you see this, then it's a sign that um, the app hasn't been patched and that the app contains Cydia and that the jailbreak is now being installed as it should. Soon. Mm. And now, when the device is booted up, we uh, should be jailbroken and we should have Cydia. Or rather, we are jailbroken and we will have Cydia. And that's the log, uh, website address. And let's see. Yep, yes, it is. On iOS uh, 9.2.1. And uh, I'm just going to show you here also to remove any possible doubt that I am running iOS 9.2.1 build number 13 D15 and that's how easy it is to jailbreak the new iOS 9.2.1 thanks for watching guys and don't forget to comment rate and subscribe and all that you know the drill thanks for watching bye